starts now. Now, folks, you just got the word tropical storm Arlene is here in the Gulf of Mexico and she is tracking down to the south here. Uh, again, no issues anticipated for a landfall in the US. Cuba, however, will have to deal uh, with that all that as it moves its way down to the south. That's basically upper level winds pushing that storm further south. Live look from Lidditz where we got some rain today and uh, check that out. We actually got some rain. I think that's great news. Not all of us got it, but we did get some. Lancaster got some too, and we have more scattered activity to the north and to the east. Now, not all of that's going to reach us, but later tonight, some more potential for, again, scattered showers, maybe a few rumbles of thunder here and there. You get later into your Saturday as well, and we also have additional chances. This is probably the best one right here with that backdoor cold front that we've been watching for the past few days. That's going to bring in another round of uh, scattered precipitation uh, to monitor and I'm not saying totals are necessarily going to be super super high but there is some potential for maybe half an inch of rain that would be phenomenal if we got it not expecting everybody to uh, to really reach that most of us will probably stay uh, some of us might not get rain at all on in if Harrisburg got zero rain that would be unfortunate but uh, many of us looking staring down the barrel of less than a few tenths of an inch and if if that and we just have a lot of dry air if you want to ask for the reason that we're not getting a lot of rain well the air just isn't there's no moisture there's no moisture to work with for these showers so when you don't have a lot of moisture you just don't get a lot of rain and you get into next week and we basically hit rock bottom again uh, with these dew points and we were at what 93 today and the dew point was 45 uh, not a good look or it a great look if you like comfort because if it was muggy, it would feel a whole lot different. But a few of us still sitting in the 90s at this point tonight. We're going to drop down into the 60s, which will feel great. I'm looking forward to that. It's great for a morning walk or something like that. And then you get into your uh, Saturday, 79 degrees. That front really taking its full effect. Rest of the week, even better. You get down to about 72 uh, for the high on Wednesday. And uh, guys, I just can't imagine a better start to June yeah. than mid to upper 70s for and your no afternoon. humidity really no humidity you. too it's going to be phenomenal outside thank you from tropical storm arlene to sports director alley